Welcome everybody to our new and improved product information call here on Tuesday nights. We are the second and fourth Tuesday of every month. We are going to have our product information call. My name is Penny Kyle and I'm located in Central California in a small town by the name of Hanford. If you're familiar with California, I'm near or between Fresno and Bakersfield. So I would like to welcome you all to these calls. You're going to hear some incredible information about products that we have here at Basic Reset. You're going to be able to hear what happened for some people who have used these products. Um, this is an incredible time for people to hear how our products work what, and what they do. I want to welcome you if you are an affiliate, but I want to pay close attention and give a big, warm, heartfelt welcome to everyone who is a guest on this call tonight. Somebody thought so much of you to have you on this call, and they thought it was so important that you be on the call to hear exactly what our product can and will do. So without further ado, I am going to turn our call over to our CEO and founder of our company here at Basic Reset, and that's Mr. Fred Kaufman. Fred, are you here tonight? I'm here. Thank you, Penny, and welcome, everyone. Well, we're very excited to bring this call back. It used to be called the testimonial call, and a lot of people don't know what happened. Why did we stop doing the uh, testimonial call the second and fourth Tuesday of every month? And there were a couple reasons for that. The main reason was we had too many people that were talking about our products as though they were a remedy. And I, I tried to remind people, if you go back and listen to any of the replays, you'll hear me say over and over and over again that these products are not a remedy. They are simply providing your body with what the body needs to be able to heal itself. And one of the problems in getting benefits from a product, or in this case our two main products are the Aqualite and Ionite, which most of you already know are uh, water additives, so they're mineral-based products that you add to water. But one of the problems of something so simple that produces such amazing results is that people start to see them as a remedy. In other words, if you had XYZ disease and you had found some improvement with your condition, let's say you just felt better, then you would have a tendency to uh, tell other people who had the same category of symptoms that here's what I did, this will work for you too, or this is what you should do because this is what I did. And the problem with that is you limit yourself, first of all, to only people who have had the same health problems that you have had. So, for example, I was talking to one of our affiliates one day, and he said, well, I'm going to try the products and see how they do for me. And if I get some results with my own condition, then I'll be glad to tell other people about it. And I said, well, wait a minute. Do you not understand that these are at the foundation of health, that water is so absolutely necessary for life that there's not a single living thing on our planet that can live without water? He said, well, yeah, I understand that. And I said, do you understand that they're never going to find uh, an herb in the Amazon or some exotic fruit in, the, in Southeast Asia or any kind of a combination of different um, uh, vitamins or other nutrients that are going to replace your need for water? Well, yeah, yeah, I understand that. And I said, do you understand that minerals are absolutely necessary for health? That first you have to have water. That's an undisputable physical law and that the minerals are right there with the water, that your body has to have minerals for every process. You couldn't blink your eyes without minerals. And he said, well, yeah, I understand that. I said, then why would you not tell people 
that they need to have Aqualite and Ionite because those are the two best products that you could get anywhere in the world for adding minerals to your diet because minerals have to be in water in order for you to absorb them. And he said, well, I guess I hadn't thought of it that way. And I said, what if you had a friend who had ABC disease? It's not something that you have, but we've had testimonials of people who said that they felt better after using our products who were suffering from ABC disease. Are you telling me that you would never tell anybody, even if it was a close friend or a relative, you would never tell them about our products, even though you knew that it helped somebody else? even though it wasn't a remedy for that ABC disease, but you wouldn't tell them because you never had it yourself. And he said, well, I'm starting to see your point. So all of that is to say this. Look, there are two things that you absolutely have to have to be alive. One is you have to have air or oxygen. But if you're alive, you're breathing. You may be on a respirator. You may be carrying an oxygen tank around with you. You may have difficulty breathing. But if you're alive, you're breathing. So let's just assume that that's the case for everything that's alive. You're, you're breathing. But you have to have water as really the primary thing that you need to stay alive. It's water. And if you don't believe me, and you can demonstrate this, some people have told me, well, my husband doesn't really drink water, but yet he's got all these health problems. And I'll say, well, why don't you go to Walmart or Home Depot or Lowe's or someplace and get the cheapest little plant that you can get, don't spend much money, and bring it home and set it down near where your spouse is that they can see it every day and only give that plant a little bit of water. Don't give it the amount that you're supposed to. Just give it a little bit of water every once in a while. And watch what happens to that plant. And tell them that that's what you're doing. You're going to do an experiment and show them how badly they need water and why it's so important to every living thing. And you'll watch that plant as it starts to wilt, and then it'll start to dry up and start turning brown, and then the next thing you know, it'll just die. Now, you can give it just a little bit more water, and you'll keep it alive, but it's still not going to be a healthy-looking plant. And your spouse is going to know, because everybody knows that. Everybody knows if you have a plant that's drying up and wilting, it needs water. <laughs> that's, that's not something you have to go to college to, to learn. Everybody seems to know that. And yet they won't drink enough water or don't see the importance of drinking the right amount of water in order to have a fuller life, in order to have a healthy life. And then the next thing is the minerals. If you start giving that plant the right amount of water after you've seen it wilt, and then you'll see the plant start coming back to life, and then go one step further, give that plant some water that has aqualite and ionite in it. I'm telling you what, people, it will really, really open everyone's eyes to the need for not only the right amount of water, but the right kind of water. And we're going to have somebody on the call tonight that's going to tell what happened to their Christmas tree, of all things, when they started watering it with aqualite and ionite water. For those of you who are part of the Basic Reset Freedom Group on Facebook, you've probably already seen the Rose video where one of our affiliates watered a rose, I think it was actually several rose plants with aqualite ionite water. And you see this, this video, and these plants look amazing. And then the, the camera spans over to one that was right next to the others, right near it, but they didn't get the aqua ionite water. And this plant really didn't look all that healthy, and it was much smaller than the other plants. That's a great way to demonstrate to people the need and the importance. And the other is uh, pets. One of the testimonies you're going to hear tonight is from someone who, and I'll, I'll not take away her story, but she watched the Bentley Miracle video 
and that prompted her to get some Aqualite and Ionite. So we have a new product for those of you who are off the radar and haven't been getting emails, don't know what all the latest excitement is at Basic Reset. We have a new product, a weight management product. We're not calling it a weight loss product because that's a structure function claim. We call it a weight management product. After all, that's really what we want to do. We want to manage our weight. We want to keep it in a normal, healthy range. And the product that we have, we, uh, I, I personally have spent years researching all these ingredients. And we finally had them all together in one formula. Now, any one of these products you could probably find on the Internet that has some benefit for helping you to manage your weight. But when you put all these things together, oh, my gosh, it's like lighting a Roman candle. All of a sudden your body says, hey, what's that you just gave me? And you're going to hear testimonials from people tonight that are going to tell you what happens. I myself have seen a reduction, not a huge drop in pounds, but what's interesting is my body fat percentage is going down. That's really the key. Uh, we have one person that's going to talk about not so much the huge number of pounds that have dropped off of the scale, but the inches that dropped off. You see, body fat weighs less than muscle, and it actually weighs less than water. So to really know if you have a weight management product that works for you, you're going to be able to tell best by taking some measurements. But most people don't have to look at a scale. They don't have to do measurements. They know when their skinny jeans start to fit again that they've got a winner. <laughs> so <clears throat> without further ado, I'm just going to tell you that it does have some stimulating effects, but that translates into energy. And who do you know that doesn't need more energy? And Randy's going to tell you what happens if you take this product in the early part of the day and then later in the day add in a little vibrant to your uh, water and all of a sudden you have a whole new experience. So we have something that everybody's looking for, something to manage their weight and something to give them energy, and it's all wrapped up into one product. Randy, uh, I think we're going to start out by talking with Margie Lastman. And Margie, are you on the call? I'm here. Okay. Uh, go ahead and tell everyone what you and uh, I had talked about on the phone, and uh, you, you're the one that had the Christmas tree story, and then you also told me about uh, your dog. Yes, uh, yes, very much so. <laughs> when I first heard about this company, I didn't even know it was your company. Um, this friend of mine told me to watch the Bentley Miracle because I had a 16-year-old dachshund that was dying, and I didn't know what it was. I just watched the video and I said okay I need to order it right now I got on there and ordered it and I saw it was coral calcium you know in the sachets which I used to use about 20 odd years ago and I think that's when I knew you had brought it from somewhere and you brought it to the United States because I knew it later from other companies but I was so happy to know that it was your company so anyway um, the following day my dog princess died so I didn't get to give it to her but after she passed away. I got on the internet and went to a neighboring town and found a shelter, Dachshund, and brought her home. They told me she had heartworms and I had to medicate her for uh, six months. So this has been about a little over a month ago that I got her. And um, she, of course, being on medicine, you know, <laughs> she'd be a little bit uh, tired and all this, but she got nervous when I left the house and would scratch on the door and bring blood. So I finally said, I'm going back. I'm going to get her another playmate. So I got another little dachshund. I thought it was a dachshund, but it ended up being a miniature pincher, a little male, and he chases this dog all over. All day long they play. And uh, I'm giving them the uh, coral water, and the ionite, they get that, and the sick dog doesn't even know she's sick. She runs just like the other one, I mean, all day long. So I'm extremely happy to have found 
basic reset. But then I started thinking about my tree because I just bought a live tree, and when I brought it home, the needles were already falling off of it because it was like 80 degrees when I bought it. And I thought, oh, goodness, so I put it in the water and all that, and then I thought, I'm going to add some uh, aqualite and ionite to the water. And so I did that. And everybody that was talking to me said, oh, no, you need Sprite or 7-Up or aspirin or whatever, something like that. I said, well, why? In nature, you know, the, the plant's in the ground and it's getting minerals. So that was the key. <laughs> every time I add a quart, which is almost every day, um, I add a sachet and two squirts of the ionite. And I've been doing that ever since I got the, the product in. And the needles have not fallen. I mean, it's like a fresh tree. I'm just pleased that I thought of it, <laughs> and I thought, well, I was going to tell Fred this, and he wanted me to share it. So it's not only good for us and for pets, but for trees and, like you say, plants and every living thing. So I, I thank you again, Fred and Kim and all of y'all at the company, for providing us with these wonderful products. Oh, well, you're welcome, and <clears throat> I'm so happy that you were able to be on the call tonight to share that with us. So it uh puts in mind exactly what I was saying earlier about the plants and uh, how even uh, our animals, every living thing, plants, animals, even bugs and bacteria can't live unless they have the right amount of water. But in order to be healthy, there must be minerals in the water. So thank you, Margie, for sharing that You're with welcome. us. You're welcome. Thank you. Now, we're going to go right back to Penny Kyle. Penny, uh, you were one of our test subjects. Now, we already knew that there were people getting results on this formula, but they weren't people in our company. And so we wanted to have people that were actually affiliates in our company so that it would be more uh, relatable testimonials. And most people know who Penny is, and she's – been so gracious to be the uh, hostess on our conference calls. And Penny, you were telling me uh, what experience you had with the trim up, and I'd just like for you to share that with us tonight. Wonderful. Can you hear me okay? Yes. Okay. Well, I actually got the trim up on um, last Tuesday, so it's a week ago today that I started it. Um, and I, my weight has gone, it's like a yo-yo all the time. And um, ever since I had my kids, because I was really thin in, in high school, and then when I had my kids, I gained a lot of weight. Um, my husband also has been heavy. And we were recently having our physicals, and both my husband and I have been actually um, classified as morbidly obese. So I was really excited when I heard about the trim up and super excited when I found out that I was going to be one of the first ones to test it. So when I started it, I take one capsule 30 minutes before my breakfast. And I noticed right off the bat, I had like amazing energy. And um, I was a little hungry before I took the capsule, but really within about 15 minutes, I was not hungry at all, but because I have problems with low blood sugar, I went ahead and I had a little something with protein in it. So normally I'd eat like three or four hard-boiled eggs and a piece of fruit. Well, I've been eating about a third of a cup of plain, non-fat Greek yogurt with um, three tablespoons of granola in it, and that's my breakfast. And I go all the way until, you know, my lunch hour, and I'm not hungry in between, between breakfast and lunch. I take another one capsule uh, 30 minutes before lunch. And, again, I, just, I was a little hungry before I took the capsule, the trim up. And about 15 minutes later, tons and tons of energy again, and I'm not hungry. So I'm, like, making myself eat, and... I have a lower calorie type um, lunch as well. So the portion sizes that I'm eating are a lot less. And then I eat a regular dinner. But I've noticed that because I'm not eating as much and I'm not eating throughout the day, even a normal size dinner that I would have 
really is I can't even eat the whole thing. And mind you, I only take the trim up in the morning before breakfast and before lunch. And I'm not snacking at night like I used to. That was my big bad habit. But here's something that is just incredible. Okay, so today marks the one-week mark. I've lost so far four pounds, but get this. Okay, I measured myself. Um, I measured my neck, my biceps, my chest, my waist, my hips, my, um, and each thigh. I did that on the very first day I started. So when I measured myself again, actually I did it yesterday just because I couldn't stand it because I know I've lost weight because my clothes are not as tight. I have lost 12.75 inches in a week. So I, it's not like I've lost this enormous amount of weight, but I've lost so many inches. And here's something even more impressive. I have fibromyalgia and arthritis. Now, our Aqualite and our Ionite has done wonders for me with the amount of pain I had. Well, now that the weather's changing, um, it's, my uh, flare-ups of pain um, have come back, but they're not as bad as they were before. Now that I'm, I've added the trim-up to my daily regime of everything I take, and I use um, all of our products, I have had zero pain. I feel so good. I feel like I'm back in my 20s again, and I'm going to be 47 in July. And I'm just like, wow, this is incredible stuff, and I am just telling every single person about it. And thank you so much, Fred, for bringing this product to us, because I know this is going to be able to help so many people. Well, thank you, Penny, and <clears throat> I'm glad you threw in the part about your pain because, again, this is really an extraordinary product. Uh, when we test something, we're always keeping our fingers crossed that people are going to get results, and it, it has not failed yet. I haven't had one person tell me that they didn't have any results from it at all, so that just reinforces again, and anybody that knows Penny knows that she's a very honest person, so these are not paid testimonials. Even though she did get a bottle of the product to try and be one of our testers, uh, she's a very honest person, and I knew we could count on her to tell the truth about what her experience has been. So thank you so much, Penny. You now we're going to go to – pardon me? I said you're welcome. <laughs> okay, so now we're going to go to Lori Mooneyham. Lori, are you there? I'm here, Fred. Okay. Well, you also were one of our uh, test subjects for the trim up, and I would like for you to share your testimony if you'd be so kind. Sure, Fred. Thank you. Um, well, actually, I'm kind of one of the later testers that are getting started on it. Um, I just started it actually yesterday. And um, it's amazing because I've been so excited about trying it and stuff. Um, I've tried so much other products on the market and nothing's ever worked for me. But last night when I took my very first trim out, I was really impressed because Probably within a half an hour, I was not feeling too hungry or anything. And when it came to my meal time, um, I fixed a normal plate as I normally would, and we had uh, roast beef last night. And I ended up eating like only one third of my plate. And I ended up giving the rest over <laughs> to my husband because <laughs> I couldn't finish it at all. I said I felt like I had eaten. Uh, Christmas or a Thanksgiving dinner, uh, I was so stuffed, and um, I had no cravings at all, and I'm a, I'm a big, huge snacker at night, um, like Penny, and uh, I, I just didn't have any desire for food, and um, so I was really excited about that and stuff, and I went to bed, and I got up like four hours later, and my body was like fully rested, I was ready to go again, and um, so I 
6 o'clock in the morning came, and I took, my, I took two more of the trim ups and ate a little breakfast. I, I ended up having just a piece of toast and a banana, and I was absolutely full. And when lunch came around, I was still full. I actually had to almost force myself to eat a little something. Um, and then I drank a Vibrant with it, and it just kept me really energized all day. And then when supper came, I took one more of the trim up, and I ate. Um, we had shrimp scampi tonight, so I, I, I probably had about four ounces, and that was it. Um, normally I eat a lot more than that. And uh, what it, I was sharing with Kim is we did a ladies' cookie exchange tonight, and I went, and everybody's snacking on chips and cookies and everything else, and I couldn't even think about food. I ended up maybe one cookie, and that was it. So it was absolutely amazing. Um, it really kept the energy going. It was a nice, steady energy all day. Um, like I said, I didn't get much sleep, so I'm doing very well, and I really am excited about seeing more results coming as time goes on. Thank well, you, Well, Lori, thank you so much for sharing that. And we have... Uh, really good news. The trim up has arrived. It arrived today. We weren't expecting it until Thursday. It arrived in today. We have hundreds <laughs> of orders. The girls are kind of a little nervous at the office because we're waiting on the label to come in and that should be in possibly tomorrow but for sure on Thursday. Uh, barring any problem at the at the printer, but it's a beautiful label. If you haven't seen it, it's in the store, uh, so you can click on that. Thank you to my wonderful wife, Kim. A lot of people don't know it, but I couldn't do Basic Reset by myself. <laughs> she does so much work. I have to literally pry her away from her computer at night with a crowbar to get her to go to bed, and as soon as she wakes up in the morning, she's got that computer on, and She's sitting there with her cup of Primo Java and just going right to work. Um, so thank you, Kim, for all that you've done to make this trim up possible. And again, we should be starting to ship out on Thursday. We probably won't get them all shipped out, but hopefully between Thursday and Friday we'll get the bulk of them sent out. And remember, for you have th that have uh, not learned yet about the trim up, it's available at an introductory price, a pre-launch price, we called it, of 25% off the regular price. So instead of $39.95, you're going to be able to get it for $29.95. I'm sorry, 25% off. I don't know if I said that right. 25% off of the uh, regular price. Uh, at $39.95, it's still a bargain. Listen to what Lori said. She's tried everything out there and nothing has helped. And we're hearing that over and over again from people. Our landlord, I'm not going to give his testimony, but our landlord is one of our biggest fans of Aquite, Ionite, and the Vibrant. And he's one of our testers also. He wasn't um, lined up to be on the call tonight, but he'll be on a future call. And he's a big guy. I, I won't give away his weight. I'll let him do that. But he's a very big guy. I mean, he's... A big, strong-looking guy has been his whole life, but he would like to be back to his what I call fighting weight, <laughs> and, and he's a long way from that. So he started making an Excel spreadsheet with his statistics, uh, watching his uh, numbers on the scale drop. So he'll be on uh, in the very near future, as as will many more people, some of you even, who have already ordered your product, you're, you're going to be sharing your testimony on a future call as well, just to encourage people. So now uh, we have one other person for Trim Up, and then we're going to switch gears, and that's a guy named Randy Steen. I think most of you know who Randy is. Randy's another guy. Without him, Basic Reset wouldn't be what it, what it is today because he has worked so diligently and so tirelessly to help us to train people and let them know how to build their business. As I said on the call Thursday, we had a 70% increase in the number of people earning a commission. Now, we had an increase in the, the dollar volume of sales because we ran a, a Cyber Week sale, 
But that didn't surprise me. I expected that. What I didn't expect was we had a 70% increase in the number of people who earned commissions. That's where we really saw growth in our company, which is really the exciting part of what Kim and I do. When we pay money out to people, we know we've changed somebody's life, not only in how they feel, but also in their pocketbook. And that's really exciting to us. Remember, our vision is to have a company full of customers who are all getting their products for free. So just think about trim up. How many people do you know that would like to get a handle on managing their weight? You don't have to throw a rock very far to find somebody that falls into that category, I'll tell you. So there's a built-in market just out there, people hungry for something that is going to help them be able to manage a problem that for many people is a lifelong problem. And I really believe it with a lot of confidence that we have the answer for most people. Now, there's always going to be somebody who says, well, I didn't really get much in the uh, way of, of results. But those are going to be very, very rare people. In fact, so far, 100% of the people who have tried trim up have gotten results. And these are people like Lori who have had difficulty finding anything that would help them. Of all of the products that are in the, the supplement market, weight loss is a huge category. There are tons and tons of products out there for weight loss. And quite frankly, we wouldn't have brought out Trim Up if there was anything else out there that was really working. Why would we? If that market was already sewed up, if it was already cornered by a product that worked, we wouldn't have any reason to bring out something. But we saw the niche that there weren't really very many, I'm not saying none of them, but there aren't very many products out there that really are effective in helping people get control of the two biggest problems with managing your weight, and that is to get control of your appetite and cause your brain to realize it doesn't need to store this extra fat. And that's exactly what we're hearing from people. So with that uh, said, I want to introduce Randy Steen. Randy, are you there? I sure am, Fred. I am here. Go ahead, my friend. All righty. Well, listen, I was privileged to, to, to like Penny, um, try this Trim Up product first. I was one of the testers. And, of course, you all know me as the guy that's, uh, when I turn sideways, I'm so skinny you can't see me, but Fred thought I should try it anyway. And <laughs> no, really, I, I wanted to try this because I told Fred one time, I said, you know, I said, Fred, um, a good friend of mine, and he's listening on the call tonight, Richard Evanson, told me one day, he said, Randy, he said, you have a $50,000 a month body. And, of course, I looked in the mirror and I thought, well, now how could that possibly be? And he said, if you could find something to help you lose the weight that you want to lose and get to where you want to be, he said, people will just, everybody that knows you will just flock to you. And then, of course, everybody that is part of that company, they'll flock to them as well. And anybody that has to lose a lot of weight, like I do, um, would have that same thing. So I was telling Fred, if we find something that helps me lose weight, um, we've really got a winner on our hands. Well, we got the trim up in and uh, the test bottles, and he sent me one. And uh, the very first day, I took one in the morning, <clears throat> excuse me, before breakfast, and then I took a uh, second one um, uh, just before lunchtime. And the very first day, I really didn't know that I felt that really felt anything any different. I mean, I knew there was, in the morning, I, I just didn't know, but by noon, when I realized that I just wasn't as hungry as I was. Well, the next day, instead of taking uh, one in the morning and one at noon, I took two in the morning when I got up. And that was around, I get up anywhere from 5 to 6 o'clock in the morning. And uh, so this was maybe around 6.30. I had a slice of toast with peanut butter on it and my two capsules before that and a cup of coffee. And um, and I and, and it was great, and I had lots of energy, and I felt really, really good. And um, later on, uh, somewhere, as I, you know, just before lunch or right after lunch, I think it was just before lunch, I thought, you know, instead of taking two more, I mean, I, my appetite had been really cut. Um, I just wasn't hungry. Normally, when I'm at my office working, um, I mean, I get the I get the munchies. I'll, I'll go to the kitchen. 
just to get a glass of water, and the next thing you know, I realize I'm sitting at my desk with more than just a glass of water. I've got a snack I'm treating on, or, uh, uh, eating on. And uh, so, at any rate, I drank this vibrant, and I have to tell you guys and gals, uh, it's like somebody put, now, and I don't want you to take this the wrong way, it's, but it's like somebody put trim up on steroids. And here's what I mean by that. It wasn't that I got any more energy than I normally have with the Vibrant when I drink it. It was fabulous energy, and I feel great, and it's wonderful. And I, it wasn't like I had this, I mean, when I talk about on steroids, I don't mean like I was pumped up with energy, but I was absolutely, it, it, it's like it kicked the appetite suppressant uh, power of this product into overdrive. I was not hungry at all. As a matter of fact, I went all the way through that day, all the way into the evening until late in the evening. And then I thought, gee, I should have something to eat. And I was starting to get a little bit hungry. You know, and I thought, oh boy, I should have something to eat. And I went to the kitchen and uh, I got something out to, to eat and I could only eat about half of it. I just was not hungry. So to make a long story short, I've been on this thing the same amount of time as Penny has. And uh, I stepped on the scale this morning, so it's one week today. And uh, I'm taking two capsules. I, I vary. Uh, but most of the time I take two capsules in the morning, and I generally don't take any more the rest of the day. This morning I took one in the morning and one around noon. Um, but I've lost 5.3 pounds. 5.3 pounds in seven days. Now, guys and gals, that's not quite a pound a day, but it's, it's it's a pretty good weight loss. Now, actually, it's a it's a pretty high weight loss when you get right down to it because that's around 30 pounds a month or 25 pounds a month. Now, I'm an overweight guy. I'm more overweight than a lot of people are, and so I'm probably going to lose weight at a, at a faster rate than a lot of people. But all I'm telling you is this, is everybody that I'm talking to that's using this product, that are testers of it, and those of you that have ordered it when you get it, Believe me, you're going to be absolutely astounded at this because uh, it's like Lori says, when you take it, you don't necessarily sit around and say, gee, I'm not hungry. But when you go to think about having something to eat, nothing, everything sounds good and nothing sounds good. You know how you, you, it's those times when you stand with the fridge door open and you're looking in the fridge and everything in there, you, normally would, you'd be like, oh my gosh, I said, that. oh no, that looks better. Oh gosh, that looks better yet. And you look at all this stuff that's good stuff that you like, and you just, uh, I don't know what I want, which is a sign of you're not hungry. And that's what it does to you. And then when you are eating, what's really interesting is, is that you'll sit down to eat. You may even feel a little twinge of hunger, but you'll sit down to eat, and you just don't have the appetites. You get into your meal, and pretty soon you realize that you're, you're kind of feeling full quicker than normal. Now, it's the power of the ingredients in this product that's doing it. And then when you add the Vibrant to it later on, and I'm not saying everybody needs to add Vibrant, but I'm telling you, if you drink Vibrant anyway, drink this Vibrant either right before lunch or sometime in the afternoon when you get in the, if you get the Sleepies, for example, and drink your Vibrant, and you're going to find out that, that when you combine something that's in Vibrant, by the way, all of you probably know it contains... Um, uh, green coffee bean, which has something called chlorogenic acid in it, which basically helps to suppress your appetite also. That's why there's a lot of people that have lost weight when they're using the Vibrant, even though it's not a weight loss product. And you combine that drink along with this trim up, and you have got a one-two punch that's absolutely unbelievable. It, it's just uh, the energy factor that you have from, the two, from both of them is great, but from the two of them combined is absolutely superb. And, and what I mean by that is it's an energy that lasts even longer. So it's, this product is something that people out there are going to be wanting to have. You've got to share it with them. And it's as simple as taking a capsule or two a day, and, um, and it's just going to cut your appetite. But think about this, 5.3 pounds in seven days. And by the way, I didn't take it on Saturday and Sunday. Now, this product is a type of product uh, that you should take at least one day a week off of it, and that's just to make sure that your body has a chance to rest during weight loss. It's extremely important that your body has that. So you should take one day a week, and you can even take two days a week off. I didn't take the product uh, Saturday and Sunday. And, uh, and uh, guess what? I still lost, so that means really it's five days 
So I guess it is a pound today. Um, I still watch 5.3 pounds. And if you don't think I'm excited about this, I'm telling you. And by the way, I took some before pictures that I'm not going to show anybody until the after pictures. Um, and I'm also keeping track of, uh, of every day on a Excel spreadsheet. Uh, now, you don't need to step on the scale every day. I am. As a matter of fact, if you go to any weight loss expert, they'll tell you to weigh yourself once a week because your weight can fluctuate even throughout the day. You can be a pound or two down in the morning, and you can be actually up a pound in the afternoon uh, because of fluid intake during the day that your body just naturally gets rid of. But um, it's just absolutely astounding. So, Fred, back to you. Well, thank you, Randy. And I'm glad you brought that up about taking a day off a week. And for some people, two days is not going to interfere with the amount of, of uh, weight management that you experience. But certainly to take at least one day off a week. That just gives you an idea of how powerful these ingredients are. That even though Randy and um, others who have taken time out, uh, we have uh, Cheryl at the office. She does the same thing. She's really busy on Sunday, and she doesn't take it on Sunday, and she's still continuing to see results. So it's exciting. And the other thing, too, is don't forget, and it's on the label, make sure you have at least eight eight-ounce glasses of water today, a day. That's uh, half a gallon. That's a minimal amount that anybody should be drinking. And what that does is it helps to flush out not only the fat, but think of this. When your body stores toxins, where does it store them? There are some toxins that get into a lot of different cells, but the main storehouse that your body has for storing toxins is in fat cells. In fact, it's so critical that you drink plenty of water while you're losing fat that it can actually cause autotoxicity, auto-intoxication. And quite simply, an example of that was a lady, I read a story, again, the name isn't important, or places and dates, it's just the general story of this woman who had been gradually increasing in weight throughout her life, and when she became middle-aged, enough was enough, and she decided to go on a radical weight loss program. And when she did, she suddenly died. And her family was really concerned what was this rare disease she had that suddenly just took her life. And they were shocked when the autopsy came back and she had died of toxicity from the chemicals in lice shampoo. Now, as an adult, she hadn't used lice shampoo, but when she was a child, Apparently, there was a, a scare about lice, and her mother wanted to make sure that she didn't get lice, and so she routinely gave her a lice shampoo, whether she needed it or not. And over the years, her body had stored those chemicals in her fat cells. And when she went on this radical weight loss program, because I believe she hadn't drank enough water, and I didn't say that in the article, but I believe that's the reason that it happened. Nobody told her when you go on a radical weight loss uh, plan, you need to drink plenty of water to not only flush out the fat cells that you're losing, but all or the fat from the fat cells, I should have said it that way. But you're also going to need to flush out the toxins that have been stored in those same fat cells. So keep that in mind. Two things. One, start out with just one capsule to see how you are uh, tolerating it. It's a, it. It is a stimulant. So for someone who drinks coffee and Two capsules might be more than what you can handle. Now, other people can drink three or four cups of coffee in the morning. It doesn't even hardly phase them. But some people, like myself, are very sensitive to stimulants. I'm doing two capsules before uh, breakfast and two capsules again before lunch. And I don't need to, to lose a lot, but I've found as I mentioned that I'm losing fat. I can see on my scale, it's a special scale that shows fat percentage. It also shows hydration. So I want to make sure my hydration percentage is up there where it's supposed to be and watching the uh, pounds and the percentage of fat drop at the same time. So those are two very important things. So we, we 
are so excited. Uh, that's what I call a grand slam, bases loaded, out of the park home run, I believe is what we have with trim up. So uh, look forward to uh, having more testimonies on, on future calls about that. Now we're going to switch gears a little bit, and uh, there's a, a, one of our favorite affiliates, Joe Munzer, actually posted a video on Facebook, and I'm going to let him tell you about that, and he's given us permission. We're actually going to put it on our website. So when you think about how am I going to build my business, if you can just get people to sit still long enough to watch a video, we've got videos that are going to get people's attention. And Joe, are you on the call? Yes, Fred, I'm here. Can you hear me okay? Joe, I can hear you just fine. So go ahead and tell people about a product that we have that's kind of a sleeper product in our lineup, but it's a product that all by itself, we could build a whole company around just that one product. If we had nothing else, we could build a very successful company. Go ahead and take it away, Joe. All right, absolutely. Uh, thanks for having me on, and also thank you for bringing back these calls. Um, I use you know most of the products in the line, and I'm one of those kind of people that you know have dove into all the information and all the inf product information sheets and learned a lot. And every time I'm on these calls, I end up learning something different. So uh, I just think, think these are fantastic. So thanks for bringing them back. Um, but the product we're talking about, I don't know if anybody's seen the video, um, is Earthwash. And uh, anybody who's seen any of my stuff on Facebook knows I am a huge dog person. We have five dogs. And uh, by the way, actually, all five of our dogs drink the water. They drink the Aqualite and Ionite water, and, and uh, I've used Ionite topically on, on the dogs, and uh, had a lot of great results with that. But um, if you have dogs, there's another thing that you have, and that's stains. <laughs> okay, uh, you know, dogs will always tend to something will happen whether they get sick or track in dirt or whatever it might be. Um, and last week, I believe it was, one of my dogs got sick on one of our area rugs. And, uh, you know, I, when she got sick, it just I mopped up a little bit of the stain just with a towel, not to, to put anything into the rug, and um, got out my earth wash and just had to brush, my, brush up on the directions to see exactly, you know, I just followed the directions that were on the usage guide and um, just sprayed it on there, let it sit, and started patting it. And within a couple of minutes the stain just disappeared and anybody who's had dogs and, and had them get sick on clothing or carpet and they know how bad these stains can, can be and this just you'll see it's almost real time I only have to turn the camera off you know for a minute or two I figured nobody really wants to sit there and watch me pat the whole time so I mean literally within five minutes the stain was absolutely gone there's not a, a mark of it and you know, honestly think that this product is hands down the sleeper of all of our products. Um, I, I use this all the time. I wash my face with it every day. I mean, how many times would you think that the, the same product that will take, you know, dog vomit out of a carpet is one that you're going to wash your face with? <laughs> okay, I wash my face with it every day. I shave with it. I normally shave with an electric shaver. But if I do use a blade, I take the foam and I use it, uh, I'll shave with it. I've shampooed my dogs with it. Um, I just I clean everything with it. Clean the floors with it. Clean the sinks with it. Uh, I clean my barbecue grill with it. There's nothing that I won't use this product on. It is absolutely fantastic. And I think that pretty much hopefully covers <laughs> what you need me to cover. But uh, I can't say enough about this product. It's absolutely incredible. Well, you've said a mouthful, Joe, and I appreciate you being on the call tonight. I, I don't know if many people realize this, but Kim and I have been married for 20 years, and that's all we've used to wash our hands. We have a foamer bottle at each one of our sinks. It's what I use for shampoo. Kim uses it to take, up, uh, take off makeup. She doesn't wear very much, but she takes off especially eye makeup and lipstick. Uh, we both use that exclusively for shaving. Now, I don't shave my legs anymore, but <laughs> uh, Kim does, and uh, it's, it's wonderful. I have, you know, I've got a little uh, mustache and a little beard around my chin, so I'm really just shaving the sides of my face and, and my neck. 
But I have these disposable razors, and they last me at least a month. Now, can you imagine that? It's like having a, a shaver on ball bearings. It just glides over that little bit of a beard that I have, but I can use that razor over and over and over and over again. I thought about joining one of those razor clubs, but they, they make you subscribe, and I would be getting too many razors, so I can't do that. But it's a great, great thing that would help make that annoying tasks that men and women go through pretty much every day. It just makes it so much more comfortable. And it nourishes your skin, too. It's, it's amazing, what, as, as Joe said, what a, a cleaning product can do in, in terms of other uses. So, uh, Joe, again, thank you for being on the call. And now I want to go to Christina James. Christina, are you there? I am. Okay. Christina uh, was telling me about a similar experience that she had with Earthwash. And if you haven't uh, tried Earthwash, it's nine ninety five, and that little two-ounce bottle will make a gallon. If you have really heavy-duty grease, uh, grease to clean, you might want to put, um, a small, put it in a smaller amount of water. So the heavy-duty cleaning, uh, Kim puts uh, that two-ounce bottle into a half a gallon of water. And then for using it as a, a, in the foamer for hands and face and um, also for shaving, you would put that two-ounce bottle into just 40 ounces of water. We recommend distilled water or reverse osmosis that has no minerals because the molecules in the earth wash surround dirt with water. And it will take anything that's in tap water and treat it as though it was dirt. Minerals and other things, it just surrounds them, and you'll end up seeing a little white residue in the bottom of the jug. It doesn't hurt anything. It's not bad. But most people uh, want to know what is that, and so we just recommend using distilled or reverse osmosis water for that reason. But, uh, Christina, please share with us what you have experienced with the earth wash, if you would. I sure will. Thank you for having me on this call. And I want to apologize now for my voice. I'm going a little hoarse here. But um, I have been using cleaning products for a while, and my, my daughter is very sensitive to cleaning products and my mom. So I, I thought I remembered I had my earth wash here, and I said, oh, my gosh, I could not believe, you know, I haven't thought about it sooner. So, you know, I grab my earth wash, and I mix it in the – gallon and I actually use the two ounce bottle to a whole gallon of, of water and I put it in a spray bottle and use it as I go. I'm borrowing my sister's car for a, for a little while so she had some set in stains in the roof, the carpet, um, the back seat and it, it's been they've been there for a while. I don't know what but either coffee or tea or something. But she said she's tried everything. So I went out there and took my spray bottle and just took a rag and sprayed it, sat, let, let it sit for about five minutes, and literally just took the rag and wiped, and the stain was gone. I took before and after pictures, and I believe I shared it in our, um, our, our group page in our, um, on Facebook. But uh, the stains were gone. The, the roof, the back seat, the carpet – um, and she didn't have any floor mats in there, so the ones on the floor was pretty, pretty um, gruesome with uh, with stains. So, but the one, I mean, it, it just it came up completely, and it doesn't. What I love about it, it's, it there's no there's no harsh smell, so you can use it anywhere. And I have um, I have pets myself, so I have you know four dogs, four cats, and a lot of things you can use around dogs is you know, sensitive to the cats, but I use earth wash for everything. I also wash my face, my hands. But another thing I wanted to um, say is um, my mom has very sensitive skin. She's diabetic. She um, has had four strokes. So her, um, she has uh, lymphedema and, and neuropathy in her legs and, and her arms. But um, she, around her, her belly area, you know, she gets um, some yeast infection. And it's, it's been often, you know, that she's used it, um, that, that she gets it. And we've tried numerous soaps and everything. And it would get really 
um, inflamed skin, really, really red, irritated for her. And um, so I, I grabbed my spray bottle and, you know, was washing her skin up a little bit, and it did not itch her. It took the, the, the pain away, the swelling, the irritation that she had, no more redness. She actually, you could see her, her skin change back to normal coloration instead of this, this irritated spot. Um, so that has been doing really well for us. Also, for the last four months, she has been um, going to the doctor about once a week, sometimes twice a week, for a wound that she has had on her toe. She had um, formed an ulcer, like a, a pressure point, which became an ulcer. And the doctor would take the scalpel and clean the, the, the area and keep it clean and put, you know, an antibiotic ointment on it and wrap it up. And so um, between doctor's appointments, I take care of it at home. So she told me to make sure it's washed thoroughly, you know, with an antiseptic and, you know, re redress it and, and, you know, uh, wrap it back up. So I used the earth wash and I sprayed it on her toe and um, scrubbed it. I wish I would have taken before pictures, but I didn't think about it. But I do have after pictures of what her toe looks like now. We have new skin growth. It's not swollen. We don't have a red ring around her toe. Um, I literally just spray it on there, wash it really good um, with, you know, a warm rag. And once I, you know, rinse it off, I, you know, just dab a little bit of witch hazel on her toe. But since using the earth wash on her toe, her toe has completely almost closed up and healed. No more pain, no more redness. Um, it's not irritated. It's I mean, it just looks fabulous. I can't say enough about the product, and I am just, I won't go without it again. Well, that is very, very exciting, Christina, and I'm so thankful that you were willing to share that on the call tonight. And remember, if you are not a member of the Basic Reset Freedom Group, that's not a corporate site. It's one that Randy, I think Penny, uh, helped him start that. Uh, page and if you are not a member but you do get on Facebook talk to your sponsor about getting invited onto that page it's a private page so you have to be invited to get on there but there's so much information on there including some testimonials just like what you've heard tonight so thank you again Christina and now we're going to go to a guy that I've become friends with over a period of time now, and I'm so excited about his story. James Seal, are you there? I hope he didn't fall asleep. James? I'm here. Okay, there he is. Well, James, uh, you have a special place in my heart because you're one of our veterans that has given us our freedom and protected our freedom. But something horrible happened to you after you got home, and I'd like for you to share that with us tonight. And uh, there was uh, another uh, couple of issues that you had, one involving your eyesight and another one involving uh, something else that you had to uh, go to the doctor about. Go ahead, James. Yes, well, uh, of course, uh, when I came home, uh, I was diagnosed with PTSD, and... Uh, um, pretty severe case, and it, it affected everything that I ever tried to do. Um, now I'm a big, big man. I'm six foot five, about 400 pounds, and uh, I got into a point of 64 years old now, where I couldn't stand up without my walker. I just didn't have any sense of balance, and I'd fallen many times and when you're this tall and that heavy when you fall it really hurts and uh, you need a crane to pick you up you know it's really hard to get up uh, but uh, so I joined you know I just was living on a small pension so I, I joined uh, basic reset to make some money to supplement my, in, my uh, income I was doing other products from these other companies, and I thought I felt great. I thought, you know, I was the best I could be. 
and the, my problems were just the problems I would have to deal with. But one day I decided that I would go ahead and try the basic reset uh, products. So I got the quadrilite and the ironite and began to add them to my half a gallon of water, which I thought at the time was an awful lot of water to drink in one day. But I just kept drinking on it, and um, by the end of the day, it would be all gone, and every morning I would get up and make another one, and I'd start drinking on it. Well, on the third day, I noticed I just felt so much better. I really can't put in the words. It's just, uh, it was like... Uh, waking up, uh, and uh, by the end of the week, my walker was in the corner, uh, my balance had returned, uh, I felt like every time I got up, I could just jump up in the air, I felt 30 years younger, and uh, so I, I was very, very excited about the uh, the effect that, that I was getting, and I added the uh, vibrant, and, um, you know, I... I used to sit down at my computer and I, I would get sleepy, like like uh, like when you're in church and the and the sermon is not particularly too good and you're fighting to stay awake. <clears throat> I'd feel like that, and uh, with the Bible, I found I could just completely focus. <clears throat> All the sleepies were gone, <clears throat> so it really uh, helped my business and. Um, so uh, I had a hernia that, on my left side that, that hung clear into my, my scrotum, uh, quite painful. And when I sat for a long period, you know, but when I sat up, it would it would get uh, it would get hot or um, it would burn a burning sensation, and I had to put my leg out or lay down for it to go away. And uh, so I went up to the VA hospital and. They all the interns and nurses and doctors came in and built of it and tried to put it back in, push it back in, and the surgery team came and looked at it and they sent me for IRA or whatever it's called where they do a sound uh, thing and everything. And, and um, so everything they did just seemed to make it worse. So I was thinking, man, I don't dare go back and up there and let them do it again, but it came time for my physical, so I went up there, and it's funny, you know, how how things can bother you for a long time, and then when they stop bothering you, you just forget all about them, because I was sitting there on the the bench, and all of a sudden I realized, hey, it it hasn't been bothering me, you know, that burning burning situation had gone away, and uh, so uh, she said, well, lay down, and and uh, so she felt, and then she got this look on her face, and she just sat down in her chair like she was shocked or amazed or something, and and she said, I'll be back in a minute, and she left. And, and a few minutes later, the door opened, and the same parade of people, interns and doctors and nurses and the surgery came, all came in and felt it, and talked amongst themselves, and, um, you know, I was scheduled for for surgery, but no more because uh, I don't know if it was uh, completely gone, but at least it wasn't hanging out the way it used to be, and and, uh, and I felt much better. And um, then as I, as I went on with the, with the, with the, with the uh, uh, Vibrant and my daily ration of, of, the, of the water, um, I noticed that when I put on my glasses, it was blurry. I take them off, and, uh, and I could see... Uh, so my vision got better. I only need my glasses now uh, for when I'm reading. And uh, so I can't wait for uh, my order of trim it to get here. And um, then as we were listening, now I've got to rush and order me some of the uh, some of the uh, uh, washing uh, stuff. And uh, oh, so. Gosh. The earth was, that's right. So that's pretty much my story. Well, thank you so much again, James. That's it's uh very inspiring. Uh you know, post traumatic stress syndrome, otherwise called P- PTSD, is a horrible, horrible plague I'll call it, that 
strikes some of our veterans that come back from these very stressful conditions of war and they come back and they have trouble entering back into society uh, as as James described the emotions just get the best of you you don't understand why and, yeah I really uh, didn't I really didn't cover that very well you know the, the symptoms are that uh, at least that I experienced was that I was always on the edge and uh, just the slightest little thing would just send me off, and it, it, you know, off the, I'd fly off the handle, and it would be, become a huge thing. I'd build it into a huge thing, and uh, people couldn't even live with you. You know, they could, they didn't want to talk to you because just a trigger word, something they'd say, and all of a sudden you'd go off, and they, and they, uh, you know, and five minutes later you're saying, oh, oh I'm sorry, you know. And because uh, you you go through these mood swings, and uh, so my my girlfriend tells me uh, after I started doing the vibrant, she said, uh, you know, you are so jolly. And after a couple of weeks, I I realized, wow, I can't remember the last time I got angry. And uh, she said, you should never be without vibrant again in your life. But she even thinks I'm getting upset. You know, she says, you do some more vibrant right now. I'll mix it for you. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Well, that's great, and uh, I'm so thankful to be part of giving you your life back, as it were, and some of the things that you talked about, I, I, I just feel so sad whenever I hear anybody tell their testimony because I think, what was life like before Basic Reset? And you're just a, a walking testimonial, and I thank you again for sharing with us tonight. Well, I just looked up the clock. It's funny how time flies when you're having fun, and we have gone well over an hour now, and I didn't intend to go that long, but it was our um, inaugural call, if you will, our product info call. We're going to have this same call, uh, well, not exactly the same. There will be new people with new testimonials, but we're going to do this every second and fourth Tuesday of the month, just like we did before with the testimonial call. And we're going to uh, send out an email with the replay information. I don't know what the number will be tonight. It's possibly going to be number 30. But either way, you can uh, see that when I send the email. But you'll be able to call that replay number and enter in any number between 1 and 29 to hear past calls that we've had. And we ended those calls in uh, July. And so it'll, it'll take you back from uh, June of, of this year all the way back to I think it was in 2015, yeah, to uh, July of 2015, so a year of those. And you can listen to some of the calls that we had in the in the past. So, again, thank you all for being on the call tonight. We appreciate you so much, and we look forward to hearing maybe your testimony in the very near future. If you have something extraordinary that happened, you can post it on the uh Facebook Freedom Group page, or just call the office and and tell them you've got a testimony you'd like to share. Drop us an email at uh, support at basicreset.com. Either way, we would love to have you on one of our future calls to encourage other people. That's what this is all about, to encourage other people. It's not to say we have a remedy for post-traumatic stress syndrome or hernias or eyesight or any of the other things that you've heard tonight. We're not saying that. We're saying, look what happens. Look how wonderfully you were made that your body can get back to normal if you give it what it needs, what it's missing. And that's the theme of the video, Diseased or Deficient. If you haven't seen that video, go to the website and click on the product tab and watch that video. If you haven't seen it for a while, go back and watch it again. It's like watching a movie a year later that you really like, but when you see it the second time, you see things that you didn't see the first time, and you wonder, how could that be? Well, that's how your mind works. It sometimes plays tricks on you, and you probably saw exactly the same thing, but it didn't register in your mind. It didn't get embedded in your memory, 
but when you see it the second time, there's something that will stand out that you think you didn't see that before, but you actually did. So God bless each and every one of you, and we look forward to being on this call with you again on the 27th of December. Uh, I know that's after the big uh, Christmas holiday, but hopefully uh, you'll all still be uh, uh, able <laughs> able to dial the phone. <laughs> I know uh, the the Christmas holiday is a lot like Thanksgiving. We have a tendency to overeat. So if you haven't ordered your uh, trim up, jump in on that sale and have that bottle ready to start on the day after Christmas <laughs> if, if you don't start it before. So, and uh, as Randy said, uh, make up your fat list. That's all the people that you know that need help with weight management and show them how they can not only get in on this with the trim up, but also how they themselves can get it for free by just referring three other people that need the same help. So, well, thanks again and good night, everyone. Thanks again to Randy and Penny for doing such a wonderful job hosting the call, and we will see you again on the 27th. So God bless everyone. Thank you.